So, oh my gosh, this is gonna be so bad. I'm sorry in advance. So I just got off work, so I'm sorry that I look like a hobo. Thank you. So let's get started. So I got Italy, and Italy's pretty lit. <laughs> I'm just thinking uh, they were really poor, but anyways. Okay, so they joined um, the war in April 1915, and they weren't doing so hot. And um, the unemployment rate was very high for Italy because of fascism. And if I look over here, I'm looking at my phone. So yeah, look what I got. So um, during the war, they were very poor and weak, and which is not very good. Um, they actually went into a Great Depression, like we did later on. But yeah, this one was pretty bad. And um, did you hear that? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get shot. <laughs> so, um, yeah, that was interesting. So a total of 600,000 Italians died in combat, combat, and over a million Italians um, either got shot, wounded, and all that stuff, which is a lot of people, okay? Uh, um, there was a huge uh, food storage, be or shortage, because they had a bad crop season so that also made them weak physically to fight and yeah so during world war one they had um italy signed the kellogg brand pact and they were one of 15 nations and the nations were um france united states united kingdom ireland canada australia new zealand south africa india um Belgium, Poland, Czechoslovakia, Germany, Italy, and Japan. And Japan just had to ruin it for everybody. And they attacked on Manicuria. Yeah, I don't know where that is, so don't ask me. Um, so you can look it up if you really want to know. So that's pretty much what happened in World War One. There was a lot of little battles, which they lost a lot of. Yeah, that's why they had so many died and wounded during this war so um yeah that's pretty much it peace <laughs>